Grade 3 Math, number 90, adding time and regrouping the hours. Yeah, you can add time. Sometimes you need to. Let's check this out. Let's say Emma's karate class starts at 3.30 p.m. A little bit after school, gives her time to get home, put on her karate uniform and get to the class. Now, if the class is 45 minutes long, what time does it end? What time does she get out? What time does she need to be picked up? Well, it starts at 3.30 p.m. and we're going to add 45 minutes. So we know 3.30 p.m. is important and we know 45 minutes is important. Okay? We're going to add 3.30 p.m. to the 45 minutes. 5 and 0 is 5, 3 and 4 is 7, and we drop down the 3. Now, there's no such thing as 3.75 p.m. There's only 60 minutes on a clock. You can't do that. So what we need to do is we need to regroup the hour. So we take 60 minutes of an hour and we subtract it from the 75. 5 take away 0 is 5. 7 take away 6 is 1. And we regroup that one hour to the hour side. So it ends up being 4.15 p.m. See how I did that? You regroup that big hour that is inside of the 75. Okay? So, here's what you need to remember. Okay, there's two things you need to really remember. When you add 24 plus 7, you have to regroup the 4 and the 7 is 11, you have to regroup the 10 and put it over here on this side and then put the 1 down here and then you add these. So you're regrouping the 10s. Well, we're going to regroup the minutes when you get to 60 minutes to a new hour. The other important thing you have to remember is you have to change from a.m. to p.m. when you go past the 12. Remember the clock goes around two times in one day. The hour hand goes around two times in one day. It goes from 12 noon to 12 midnight. So let's take a look at this one. It's 2.40 p.m. and we're going to add 30 minutes. 2.40 p.m. plus the 30 minutes. 0 and 0 is 0. 4 and 3 is 7. And we bring the 2 down. Now, there's no such thing as 70 minutes on a clock, so we need to regroup 60 minutes of an hour to the hour side. And we do. And we get 3 10 p.m. Okay? Let's try another one. Alright? It's 11 o'clock at night. See? 11 p.m. It's almost, it's an hour from midnight. Okay? It's p.m. 11 o'clock p.m. plus 3 hours. We're going to add the three hours, and we're going to get 14 o'clock. Well, there's no 14 o'clock. Once it gets to 12, we have to regroup. So we take the 12 o'clock, the 12 hours, the one time around the clock, and we subtract it from the 14, and we get 2 a.m. It changes from p.m. to a.m. So let's see how this happened. We were at 11 o'clock p.m. One hour went by, and it was 12 a.m midnight, 12 a.m. Another hour went by and it was 1 a.m. and another hour went by and it was 2 a.m. So the clock went, the hour hand and you know the minute hand went around from 11 to 12. That was 1. To 1 o'clock is 2. To 2 o'clock is 3 times around. But it changed from 11 p.m. to a.m. when it passed the 12. See? All right, now we're going to do one that's a little harder, so put your thinking caps on, okay? It's 10.30 in the morning, 10.30 a.m. We're going to add 3 hours and 40 minutes, okay? It's 10.30 in the morning, and we're going to add 3 hours and 40 minutes. So the hour hand is going to go 3 hours, and the minute hand is going to go an extra 40 minutes, okay? So we have 10.30 a.m. and our 3 hours and 40 minutes. We add up the ones minutes and get zero. We add up the tens of minutes and we get a seven. And then we add up the hours and get 13. Boy, is that a funny time, 1370 o'clock? Yeah, there's no such thing as 1370 o'clock. 
So the first thing we're going to do is regroup an hour out of that 70, and we're going to give it to the 10 side. 70 take away 60 is 10, so now we have 14 10 o'clock. Now we have to take the 12 hours away from this. 14 10 minus 12 is 210, and we've changed from PM because we did the 12 hours. Okay, let's see what that looks like on the clock. The hour hand is going to go around three times. All right, we're at 1030. One time around is 1130. Another time around is 1230. Another time around is 130. That's three times around. So now we're at 130 p.m. Okay, because it changed from a.m. to p.m. when we passed the 12. Now, if we add the 40 minutes to 1.30 p.m., it's going to go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, and it's going to be on the 2, the minute hand's going to be on the 2, which is 10 minutes. See? So that'll change it from 1.30 p.m. to 2.10 p.m. And it's not morning anymore. It's not a.m. anymore. It turned to p.m. when it passed the 12. Now, this might be a little hard to understand, so if you have to, watch the video again. Get yourself a clock and spin the minute hand around and try these times and add them on the clock and make the clock spin around. And you'll see that you can add time by regrouping the hours with addition actually and subtraction. See? So regroup just like you would when you regroup your tens. Next video, I'm going to show you how to subtract time when you need to go back in time. Okay? See you there.